from Lady Gaga's emotional acceptance speech to doubling up on wins. E.T. is taking a look at a few of the standout moments from the 24th Annual Critics' Choice Awards. And the Critics' Choice is... A tie. It's a tie. A-list ladies shared the stage with not one, but two ties of the night. Crazy, crazy. We got a tie. Both Amy Adams and Patricia Arquette won for Best Actress in a Movie Made for TV or Limited Series, while Lady Gaga and Glenn Close took home the Best Actress Award for their work in The Wife and A Star is Born. Gaga couldn't help but hold back tears as she thanked her love, fiancé Christian Carino and co-star Bradley Cooper. Thank you, Christian, my love. And kept going like a true star when they tried to cut her off. It's okay, I can still do this with a piano background. How are you balancing it all? A casual Vegas residency with award season campaigning. Oh my God. Uh, you know, it's a lot of hard work, but I have a wonderful team and we love what we do. And it's, it's been amazing. I get to celebrate, you know, the art of so many of my peers. And then I also get to sing my pop show in Vegas, and then I have a jazz show as well, which I love. I love to sing jazz, so I'm enjoying that too. The Crazy Rich Asians cast was overwhelmed with excitement as they took home the Critics' Choice Award for Best Comedy. I mean, it's going to be hard to top the first film, so yeah, I mean, I don't know what they're going to do. How can they make it bigger, <laughs> bigger and crazier? And although Rami Malik and Nicole Kidman did not meet back on stage after their hilariously awkward moment from the Globes, E.T. was with the pair on the red carpet ahead of Critics' Choice, where the longtime friends laughed off the viral moment. Nicole Kidman, are you guys going to make up for that viral moment tonight? Will we get another interaction on stage? Uh, Nicole's the best, and we've been having a laugh about it together. She's, uh, she's another one I've admired for so many years. We're really good friends, yeah. so that's why I just did not feel his hand on my back. I was mortified that... <laughs> So, no, I love that man, and he's so gentle and softly spoken, he's a darling.